Hey, hey friends, welcome back or welcome if you are new. My name is Sammy and welcome back to today's grocery haul or this week's grocery haul, I should say. I did a Walmart pickup order, but it's more of a prepper pantry haul than a normal grocery haul because we are pretty much stocked up on everything that we need here at the house. So I wanted to fill up my pantry with some staple items that you need to keep around. Tis the season for soups and baking and all the good stuff. So anywho, I'm going to run over to Walmart, get this order, come back, set it up, and I'll show you everything we got. Open up the window. I'm breathing in the last of September. I can feel the wind blow. And the late summer sky is like a dying ember Everything is turning into gold When the autumn leaves are blown Alright guys, we are back. We've got everything set up. It doesn't look like a lot, but it is a lot of stock up items. And then I got the two shelves, which was the bulk majority of it. It was about $70 for both of those. So that took a good chunk of change to get them. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and flip you around, show you everything we got, and then we're gonna get these shelves assembled, put them in the um, place where we're gonna keep everything now in the prepper pantry. And we're gonna get all of this um, put away. And then I've still gotta finish all of that. So, but anyways, that's neither here nor there, but let's get into today's grocery haul. All right, so we have two of these, um, Hyper Tough, the four shelf plastic um, heavy duty shelving units. So I have two of those. Back here I got a bag of Fruity Pebbles, but the Malto Meal brand because they taste better. I have um, a Malto Meal for the Apple Jacks. We just like this brand better than the name brand. So we have a bag of each of those. I've got a bunch of bananas, a head of cabbage because I'm making unstuffed um, cabbage roll soup. Um, so I needed a head of that. I got two packs of the two pack cream cheese, two packs of butter, two things of chicken broth, two things of beef broth. Sorry for the glare, I apologize. <laughs> Back here I have two things of just normal all purpose flour, two things of a granulated sugar. I have three packs of the onion soup mix and three packs of the beefy onion soup mix. Here I was substituted for the massive jars of hot sauce, which is fine by me. Um, they didn't have two of the smaller ones, so we got two of the 24 ounces. We like hot sauce. <laughs> that is our favorite kind, so that'll last us for a while. Back here I got two boxes of the Chewy Fudge Duncan Hine Brownies. Two of the two pound bags of Pintos, because I think I only have one bag left, and we like our Pintos or soup beans, whatever y'all call them. Um, for pasta this week, I got two boxes of Rotini, two boxes of Elbow. I got two things of the ranch dressing seasoning mix, two packages of bacon. All of this stuff is for the prepper pantry, so this is all going to be just stock um, just to put back in there. And then back here we got four things of ketchup. I don't know if y'all have heard yet or not, but I've heard several channels talking about it and some of my friends as well. But there could be a tomato and a potato shortage. So um, I stocked up on a lot of tomato products that we use, including the hot sauce. Um, I didn't have any jelly put back, so I got a strawberry and a grape to put back. Two more things of the Duke's mayonnaise, because it's our favorite. I got an eight pack of tuna. We love tuna around here, so I got an eight pack of that. Back here, I got two cans of Great Northern beans. I got six cans of cream style corn, I think. No, they're mixed. <laughs> I got three cans of cream style and three cans of um, just the whole kernel down here. I got four cans of French style green beans, 
four cans of chicken broth. I ordered four cans of beef broth, but they were out, so I only got two of them. Two cans of chili beans. Four of the large cans of the crushed tomatoes. I got six of the petite diced tomatoes. Um, six tomato sauces and six cans of the whole peeled tomatoes and then i got four cans of um the rotel but it's the great value brand so i got four cans of that for soups and stuff and then i picked up two more cans of our favorite green beans right here i've got three cans of sauerkraut we do love that around here right here i got two more bags but this is the unbleached all-purpose flour i'm going to make another sourdough starter and that's what i use for mine so um, i went ahead and got two bags of them i do have two cans of evaporated milk because you know baking season is coming up so i wanted to go ahead and get some of that i got four cans of tomato paste right here i got two jars of the tomato basil garlic great value pasta sauce and then i got two jars of traditional i picked up some well it's a four pack of the campbell's tomato soup it's the only kind of tomato soup that i like besides when i make my homemade but i didn't have enough tomatoes to do that this year and can it so um i'll just stock up on the campbell's i got Four packs of the Jiffy Corn Muffin Mix. It's our favorite. And let's see. Did I say the two cans of sweetened condensed milk? That'll go over there. I got four bottles of vanilla. And two containers of ground cinnamon. Oh, that's those are also for my cinnamon rolls too. Because I have a lot of yeast when I went to Sam's Club. So I don't need no rapid rise yeast. Because um, I have it in the freezer for when I need it. I picked up some parsley flakes, curry powder, and cayenne pepper to keep on hand because I didn't have any of these, so I needed to get them. And I think I said the bacon and the ranch as well. Yes. And then down here, I um, ordered two of the pineapple coconut, the sparkling um, water. These are so good. So we ordered two of those. I ordered another spice rack so I could organize the second shelf in my um, seasoning cabinet spice cabinet so I needed another one of them as far as non foods go that was the first thing of course we had the shelves over there too but I got a two pack of Febreze air fresheners I picked up another Lysol laundry sanitizer and this the wrappers all wonky on it but I picked up um, a Lysol washing machine cleaner and sanitizer because that'll be happening today as well and then I picked up um, a small little thing of um, the laundry detergent that we use. It's just like game, but it's cheaper. So I picked up one of those to kind of get us through until next week. Because um, we still have some. So, And I'll be stripping beds and stuff tomorrow. So I'll need some more. But that is everything that we got on this grocery haul. I did have three gallons of milk, but they are not pictured. Um and a 40 pack of water that I bought for my husband to take to work with him. So those two things are not pictured, but it was part of this grocery haul. So that is everything that we got. And like I said, I will have the total down here at the bottom like I normally do, but I hope you enjoyed this haul. If you do, leave me a thumbs up and a comment below and think about subscribing and becoming part of my YouTube family. I would absolutely love to have you here. But until next time, y'all, I hope y'all have a blessed week and stick around for the meal plan because it's coming next. Until next time, God bless. Bye.